The problem of our time and age is one thing. Freedom is misinterpreted and misdefined. They will encourage you. And please pay attention. I may stop here. I won't go any further because I really want to get this message across to you guys. It is coming from someone who lived your life before you. And I've passed the stage and I know exactly what awaits you. I know exactly. I know exactly. We are living at a time and age where freedom is misinterpreted and misdefined. A government, and please, I want everyone to listen. A government has no right to tell you how to live. Your parents have the right to tell you how to live. Family. But the problem is, the problem is, when there is imbalance in a family, we have an imbalanced society. And when the rule that is placed by the government that once you are a mature 16 years of age you decide to leave home you are absolutely free and no one can stop you i just wonder a 16 year old an 18 year old a 20 year old a 30 year old for that matter how much do you know about life and the ins and outs of that life not much my dear friend a teenager will always come and say, I know what I'm doing, mom, dad. That's what they will say. I know what I'm doing. And they see that mom and dad are nothing but an obstacle, are nothing but a hindrance, are nothing but a pain in the neck because they are standing in my way and they are not letting me to have fun, enjoy life and experience it for myself. Okay, mom and dad, you say this is wrong, but let me experience it and let me find out for myself if it is right or wrong. Well, if I let you experience it, it may be too late because the damage will be much greater than you and I to be able to fix. Jesus Christ is the ruler of every king of the earth. The problem of every kingdom, of every nation, of every country is one thing. The day that nation denies the existence of God, we lose origin, we lose meaning, we lose morality, and we lose destiny. We lose our origin, we lose the meaning to that origin and we lose the morality of life and we lose the destiny. Where am I gonna end up at the end? I'm lost. When a nation believes that every human race came from mother nature, there is no origin. Therefore, the ape is your granddad next time you go to Taronga Zoo and you see that gorilla in there throw him a banana and say goodbye grandpa when we take God out of that equation there is no more meaning to nothing I ask someone who believes in nothing then what are you, who are you, and, and what, what are you all about? If you believe in nothing, then you're nothing. Because what you believe in is what makes you. Then if your belief is in nothing, then next time you talk, I'm gonna deny you totally because a nothing is speaking. Where is the meaning in here? The meaning of what a human is all about, nothing. And then the morality, moral values. 
Maybe what I'm saying to some of you are too big of words. I'll try and be very simple as much as I can. Moral values is who is going to teach me what is right and what is wrong? Who's going to tell me this is right and this is wrong? Am I going to be just free in the sense I decide what is right and wrong? So therefore, mom, to me, you don't exist. Dad, to me, you don't exist because I'm living in a country. They're telling me you are free. No one can stop you. So at the age of 15, 16, 17, 18, in my 20s, I'll do whatever I want because it's a free country. And I decide what is morally is right and what is morally wrong. I decide. Then my question as a teenager, what do you know about morals? What do you know about values? What do you know about life? Yet it is so complicated, so deep in meaning. Not, not much. You're still living that life. You haven't lived it for you to understand it. I remember once this girl came to me crying crying like a baby like there was rivers of tears gushing down her face father father i'm destroyed father what's wrong my daughter my boyfriend left me how old are you my my darling 16. how long have you known this guy four years father i started counting backwards 16 minus 1, 15, minus 2, 14, minus 3, 13, minus 4, 12. So you were still drinking milk in a, in a dummy. Guys, pay attention. Anyone comes to you and says, don't listen to mom and dad, go out as you please. Do not befriend that person. Anyone says to you, you can do whatever you want. You're absolutely free. This is Australia. They are lying to you, lying. Anyone that says it does not matter if this guy chooses to be a male or a female or in between. It is a free country. We should love one another. Same sex marriage is no different to any other marriages we do not accept it because our Jesus says otherwise.